Hello viewers and welcome back to our next entry in our World Cinema series. After wrapping up in Europe last month, we're now moving eastwards where we'll be focusing on the Middle East and Western and Central Asia. As always, make sure you check the description down below for our definition of eligibility specifics and much more. Starting off, we have Afghanistan and the Golden Globe winning film Osama. Moving up to the Caucasus, we have Armenia and the Soviet film The Colour of Pomegranates. Next door in Azerbaijan, we have the 1936 film by the Bluest of Seas. Down in Bahrain is the eponymous A Bahraini Tale. <laughs> Back up north in Georgia, the classic war film Father of a Soldier. From Iran, the Oscar winning hit, A Separation. <laughs> Next door in Iraq, Son of Babylon. From Israel, Ari Folman's animated documentary, Waltz with Bashir. Across the border in Jordan is Phoebe. <laughs> Up in Kazakhstan, Tolpan. From Kuwait, Cruel Sea. Kyrgyzstan, Queen of the Mountains. From Lebanon, we have the highly acclaimed Capernaum. From Oman, Zayana. Pakistan, Bol. From Palestine, we have the winner of the Golden Globe, Paradise Now. From Qatar, the short film Falling Leaves. I, uh... 
Saudi Arabia, Wajida. From Syria, the night. Up in Tajikistan, the comedy drama Luna Papa. <laughs> Turkey has made some incredible movies, with Winter Sleep a close pick. However, we've gone with Once Upon a Time in Anatolia. What happened? <laughs> From Turkmenistan, Neveska. From the UAE, City of Life. Up in Uzbekistan, 2000 songs of Farida. And finally, from Yemen, 10 days before the wedding. Thank you for watching the third video in our series, make sure you hit the subscribe button for our weekly top 10s and of course for our next entry in the series where we'll be looking at the other half of Asia.